YouTube. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start a little vlog series basically so the first spot is going to be the spot that i go to the most to get my sneakers on release dates and i'm going to stop by the stores and show you guys what stores i normally go to and what i go there for also you know it's going to be a series because i'm going to try to go to every store in the city that i would go to why i go there and what i go there for and what i get when i go there so people call it spots so i'm gonna say spot one spot two break it up in a different video so i want you guys to hit that like button hit the subscribe button so you can be notified as soon as i drop the next video of the next spot so let's hit spot one all right guys so this first spot you know y'all been here before with me this is the old thought mall um so I'm gonna show y'all what stores I go in here. Normally it's only four shoe stores that's that's main and then you got like DTLR and Jimmy Jazz right outside of like Foot Locker Champs or something like that. So I'm gonna go in here and show you guys what they have in here today. And you know, we all know, and I'll kind of explain, you know, why I come in these stores. And we all know the main stores I come in, you know, to get the raffles and stuff like that on release date for the sneakers. But um, this is spot one. So. Let's go check out spot one and see what they got in here today, and then, you know, we'll go from there. All right, we first gonna start with Macy's. Hey, what? This, this Macy's got a finish line in the store. Normally I hit Macy's for like, you know, like 501s, stuff like that, cause you know I'm, I'm, I rock Levi's. That's pretty much what I wear for, you know, jeans or pants or whatever, even shorts. You know, I rock with the Levi's. Um, shirts, you know, I do T-shirts, Nike, Jordan T-shirts, and you know, when it comes to like the polo shirts or collared shirts, you know, I do pretty much polo. So, you know, what I'm saying just an original guy. Don't really do too many trends. So, got DTLR. It's Friday, so typically you can see this mall is pretty much empty, which all of our malls pretty much be, but next up we're gonna take a look at foot action. Still got laser fours in here. They still had laser foils in that joint. Inside. Foot action. So. You know, next stop we got finish line. Hey. <laughs> huh? Sit. Hey, bro. you say you from uh from New York? I'm in I'm in the Overthought Mall. You see, I got on the. The, <laughs> the bulls of a Broadway 10. <laughs> you got about to do something to them, man. Huh? Got on the 10s, man. Yeah, Broadway, man. Bulls of a Broadway, man. It's like you just take a little bit of cleaner on the brush. Mm -hmm. And stand on my right for me. And you just want to start from the bottom like Drake said. And you want to scrub it back and forth like an argument. When okay. you see that white foam, that's how you know it's working. It works on leather, suede, new buck, cloth, canvas, mesh, and rubber. Even, even leather and vinyl. 
It's gonna get out all type of stains. It's gonna get out grass, grease, oil, clay, dirt, mud, sauce, strip of sweat, ski stains, dude stains, anything. I can't believe I'm chucking this dude. <laughs> <laughs> all you do is brush it on, take cloth, you and wipe it off. Yeah. So I guess it gotta dry, cause you know that's leather. Yeah, it's gonna so dry. It's the leather yeah. is soaks in a little bit in certain spots. Yeah. But I promise you, when you walk around, it's gonna come back clean. Yeah. Basically, and the last and most important step is our liquid Teflon. You know, moms always say you should protection. It's uh -huh. a water and stain repellent. It's gonna waterproof the shoe. Keep stains from getting back on the shoe. It's gonna prevent creases. You just gonna do one shoe? Yeah. Can I move you up, I move you up. <laughs> yeah, man, what you mean? I can't believe this dude. I'm letting this dude put some chemicals on my on my bulls of a Broadway, man. All natural, non-toxic. Oh, right, so non-toxic? All natural, non-toxic, tell Okay. Hey, you can tell me about it. What, what it do? You tell me about your little product, oh, man. Look, put, I'm, you gonna be my, my channel is uh, Uncomers.com, man. So. Okay, okay. I'm, Check it out. We out here in Savannah, the Overdorf okay. Mall. All right. What I got right here is a product. It's called Refresh, all natural, non-toxic shoe cleaner. Okay. All right. Basically, what it does is turns your shoes and brings them back to life. All right. Basically, it's got two bottles of my cleaner and conditioner, the white touch-up, and the water and stain repellent. The water and stain repellent is liquid Teflon. Instead of protect your shoes from future stains and scuffs. Clean toes on Sundays. All right. okay. But it works on leather, suede, canvas, clean nylon, toes on cloth Sundays. rubber. It gets out grease stains, grass, old clay, mud, tar, sweat, ketchup, mustard, piss stains, shit stains. How much it costs? Oh, bro, the whole entire set, man. I sell it in Augusta. Okay. Bro, for 49 bucks. 49 bucks? Yeah, bro. Okay. When I come in Savannah, bro. I'm selling it for 39. 39? Yeah, buddy. What kind of deal is that? <laughs> exactly. I mean, I gotta, I mean, I gotta see it in action first, you know. I might, I might come back and check y'all boys out, but I appreciate it, man. Cause like right now, I'm a little, I'm a little skeptical, I'm a little skeptical yeah. about. It. <laughs> but I know it's leather; they probably are dry, you know. But I mean, I just let these dudes run, rub some unknown solution on my bulls of a Broadway. Like, <laughs> I mean, they don't look like it did no damage, so you should be good. Check out Foot Locker. Yeah, especially this this heel part yeah. right here. Even on the um on the twelves, that, that little like that, that little pod, that little yeah. part right there in the back, you can, can kind of feel, feel it. it. Yeah. yeah, definitely. But yeah, those zoom soldiers are gonna be dope. I think people are gonna like those. Yeah, but these these are definitely a lot better. I'm a for they they're stepping yeah. they're ste they're stepping the right direction on yeah, the um definitely. from the from the the mid thirteens for sure. I'm a sucker for so. those. Yeah, definitely. I, I'm gonna I'm gonna leave, give me one or two pair though. I had bought my little boy these. They look they look a lot better in, in, in GS sizes because they don't got that little light bolt across the foot. Oh yeah. In in this part, so they look they look I a like lot better. Those, in GS. I like the black with the gum bottom. I like these. Yeah, too. I know. I, size. I yeah. Like if I bought some, oh these are hundred bucks. I mean. Because like that doesn't look like just a, like a yeah bottom, yeah. Because you can't really tell like. Because all those po posits pieces. They kind of they kind of blend in yeah. yeah. These was dope too. Man. Yeah. I just can't get this. Th this what did it for me. This part right here. Yeah. And that, and that lightning bolt. The lightning bolt got me too. Yeah. So. What'd you say? I got one of the fights on the pearls. Yeah, man. Interesting conversation popped off in there about the LeBron 13s. Now, the LeBron 13 low. Nah, I'm going to wait till they come down on the price on sale because they always do because nobody really buy the lows like that. So, I'm going to wait till the price drop. Now, I'll probably grab some lows, but. Yeah, but them 13s, the mids, can't do it. Hey, Jimmy, 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 J
um, they got the same stuff in there, you know, some interesting stuff broke out conversation wise, as far as the LeBron 13s, you know, when I was in Foot Locker talking to them or whatever. So let me know what you guys think. You know, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, share my videos, and uh, make sure you subscribe because, like, this is spot one. We're going to hit spot two. So when I upload the video to spot two, I want you guys to be notified so you can see what's going on in spot two. Thank you guys for watching my videos. And as always, until next time, see you in the next video.